Hello my bookish lovelies, Kira here, and today I am super excited. The Glimmer and Gold box by Illumicrate just arrived. It may not look that big, but it's heavy, so I know that there's quite a bit of stuff in here. I am never disappointed by Illumicrate. I always love the stuff that they put in their boxes, and I'm super excited to see what they put in this. This is for their Chain of Gold Collector's Edition box. I, I love their Collector's Edition boxes. I'm, I'm kind of hoping like that there's going to be a blanket in here because I'm always banking like every time I get one of these special edition boxes I always kind of bank like that there will be a blanket because blankets tend to be my favorite things like that are in the box I am a glutton for blankets so let's go ahead and get into this unboxing because I'm just super excited to see what's in this all right Ooh. all right so this is what the card looks like, which is gorgeous. I love the detail around this. It's the glamour and gold for the chain of gold collector's edition. This is oh, a bunch of spoilers inside this, so I definitely don't want to get into what's in this unless I need to, but I am super excited. Oh, let's go ahead and just get into it because like, I'm just so excited. Okay, I'm going to calm down there for a second. It's kind of like a long jewelry box. Is this a letter opener? Okay. This looks like a letter opener. It's a little sword! Of the same steel and tempo as Joyce and Dur Durndal? It has an inscription on it. It's a little knife. It it almost looks like a letter opener, but it's doesn't it's not doesn't have the sharp enough edges for that. It might just be a replica. It is a letter opener. The heirloom Caristar's blade. Car Stars Blade to be wielded by you to open letters or make your Instagram pics look wicked cool. And that was done by Fable and Black. Fable and Black actually does their um, pins also. And I'm really excited because like they're going to be starting to include the pins into their main boxes so I don't have to order the pins separately anymore. And I, I love my bookish pins so I'm really excited about this. But this is gorgeous and I'm so excited for this. It doesn't, like, I'm kind of surprised, like, it doesn't, like, really look like too, too much like a letter opener because it doesn't have the sharp edges. So I was kind of, like, wondering, but it's also just a pretty, like, little, little sword. I love it. Let's see what else we have in the box. Yes! Exactly what I was hoping for. It is a blanket. It has to be. And I think I accidentally saw it, but, um, hold on. Mortal Instruments blank Blanket is by... Yoshi Yoshitani. I'm going to put the name down there just in case I pronounced it. It's featuring the mortal cup, the mortal sword, the mortal mirror, and is, and is the perfect blanket to curl up under whilst reading Chain of Gold. Okay. I'll open this. They always show just a little bit, but... Oh. This, look at that coloring. I love the color. This is actually going to go perfect with my room because I actually have a brown and red pattern for my room color scheme. So let's go ahead. We got the, the mirrors towards the bottom right there. And we have the sword. Oh, this is so soft too. It's so soft. I love it. Oh, I always love getting the blankets. Blankets are always like my favorite thing like in these boxes. And I always, and like it never fails. It seems like Illumicrate always includes the most beautiful blankets like in their crates so I'm just so excited for that this is gorgeous I'm so I'm, I'm ecstatic oh my god it says chain of gold tea for one and I have a feeling that this is this this looks like it's a teapot this is so big and it's heavy chain of gold tea for one it is a teapot it's a teapot I have never seen a teapot inside a box before God, I'm so excited. So, we have this little plate. Imagine that this is what the um, teapot goes on. And I imagine, and this is ceramic, so it's actually like very sturdy. Don't want to drop it still, but. And then we also have this little top here. Ooh, the detail on this. So, if you look at the um, original the the regular um chain of gold cover you'll see like this almost looks like the gate and then we also still have like some of the leaves too that are all around this this is a very beautiful top Ooh, and there's a teapot 
Oh. It says, tea is always an excuse for a clandestine adventure. Look at the detailing on this. This is so cute. And I happen to be a huge fan of tea. So this will actually be absolutely perfect for me. Look at the detailing. This looks like the gate on the chain of gold cover. Oh, this is so pretty. Like, I am in awe of this. We have the only thing that's basically colored is the lettering and then the leaves. And then the leaves are also all along this right here. So I'm going to put this back together and see what it looks like. So we have the little top, little teapot top. And it's this beautiful little teapot. I've, like I said, I've never seen any teapots included in these before and I cannot be happier because this is just the cutest little teapot. I love this so much. Oh, it's just, it's just so perfect. There's more in this box. What else is in here? Oh, is it a cup? There's even a teacup in here, guys. Let me get that out. This is so perfect. Oh, I wonder if it's one of those ones that stacks. It is. It stacks into the cup. So you have your little teapot. I might have to use this really soon. The teacup itself has all of these gorgeous detailing like of the leaves. Look at how beautiful that is. This is just so perfect. I love this so much. And just like the teapot, we have the leaves here along the sides. This is just so pretty. I am in awe of this. I love this so much. This is really such a surprise. This is such a pleasant surprise because like I said, I'm a huge fan of tea. I actually don't drink coffee. I only drink tea. So for me, this is absolutely perfect. What is this? Let me open this one. Oh, bridge through the triptych. Designed to look like stained glass windows. This beautiful display piece features our favorite infernal device duo. Look at this. Look at the detail. And it's just supposed to stand up like on its own. So pretty, look at that. Oh, I love this. This looks, I believe that this was by Rosie Thorne 88. I'm gonna be putting like the link of, like, I'm gonna be putting like the name of the artist like down here, but oh my god, this is so perfect. And just kind of folds up together. We have Shadow Hunter playing cards. So just to see let you see what these look like. The ace is a is the Hernandale ring. This is what the back of this looks like. As a joker, we do have Anna Lightwood. Queen as Grace Blackthorn. King as James Hernandale. The ace is the Clockwork Angel. I think the, the hearts are officially my favorite because in the jack we have Gem Car Stars. We have Tessa Gray. Will Hernandale. And then we for the spades, we have Church, the cat. Then for the jack of spades, we have Thomas Lightwood, Lucy Hernandale. Christopher Lightwood, and then the Ace of Diamonds is Gem's Violin. Then for the Diamonds, we have Gem Car Stars, we have Cordelia Car Stars, Matthew Fairchild, and then we have these, these are the Jokers. I love these cards. These cards are so pretty. Where did I put the box? Oh, down there. I love these cards so much. I love the detail. Oh, we got two art prints. This is our first art print. This looks like this is more geared towards Clockwork Angel and the Infernal Devices trilogy. And then we have this. And this looks like this is more geared towards the Chain of Gold. So we actually have the best of both in this because I think they realize like that people like that are fans of the Clockwork Angel and the Infernal Devices are also going to be huge fans of this series as well so I'm really grateful and there is kind of like a foil detailing to both of these if you see like the shine in this which is gorgeous so that which has the which has the detailing in the background which looks like little gears all right so we're almost down to the last bit of the box the book is what we have left so, 
open and open this. All right, we have orange sprayed edges and already I'm really excited. So and I like to do this so that you guys see it before I do. If I can get it out. This book is just a big book because it's happened like with the other one that I unboxed just here. Ooh, it's green. Look at this edition. Look at that. This is so pretty. I love this. This is also exclusive to Illumicrate. And then we have another art print. I believe that this is the same exact art print that we had in the other box that I got as well. But so satisfying seeing that. Such a big book. Oh, I love this though. It's so pretty. With this beautiful spine. I really, really have gotten to sit down and get caught up on all my Cassandra Claire. I am a little bit behind on her stuff, so I do need to get dig, dig into it. But um, the Infernal Devices series was always my favorite, so I was really, really excited to know that they were going to be continuing on with that series with the Chain of Gold. So, and this is the last hours, and this is the last hours of book one. Look at that, it's so pretty. Well guys, thank you guys so, so much. That completes everything that was in the box. I am so excited. This is just, this is, as always, Illumicrate never fails to surprise and amaze and I'm just so excited for everything that's in this box. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys like this video, hit the like, hit subscribe, hit the little bell icon if you guys wanna receive emails every single time I post. I'm also on Instagram, Amazon, Twitter, and Goodreads. Those links are linked in the description below. I hope to see you guys again very, very soon. And I will talk to you guys again later.